What's oh, up, man? Look, man. Look, look, look. Listen, listen to me. I have something to tell you, okay? It's very, very important. You are an amazing person. But do you know why that is, my friend? Do you know why you are an amazing person? You are amazing because I said so. And do you know why I said that you are amazing? I bet you don't. I don't either. I don't either. I don't, I don't, I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, I yeah, I don't either. But thank you for tuning into this video. Let's get started with today's Tinder Tasty Days. Listen, man, before we get started, if you like this video, which of course you're going to like it, make sure you actually hit that like button, bro. Don't forget that guy. That guy is special. That guy means that that, that guy gets shared to other people, which means that guy, that guy, that guy grow. That guy needs to grow, bro. But yeah, guys, if you guys want to help out the channel, go ahead and hit that like button. Leave a comment so the algorithm of youtube can be like this guy's content is obviously good because people liked and they actually clicked the like button you know if you want to see me grow as a content creator which i hope that you do because i just hope that you do then hit that like button let's go ahead and get started with today's ttt triple t tinder tasty motherfucking t days bro if you guys don't know what tinder tasty t days is tinder tasty t days is basically when the family and i come together and and we get lit okay you guys being the family because you guys are awesome i love you guys but yeah we get together we get lit we, we rate blah, 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 we rate wizard 101 stickers sent in by you guys via twitter using the hashtag tinder tasty t days if you beautiful person amazing awesome uh freaking uh person want to submit your own stitch for tinder tasty t days all you got to do head over to twitter make a post using your image leaving the hashtag tinder tasty t days adding me in the posts smojo sf make sure you follow me so i can grow those numbers you know what i mean and uh yeah i'll see that guy i'll rate that guy you'll see your guy on this guy and yeah let's go ahead and get started with i think this is number 13 number 13 of tinder tasty t days my friend we got a post sent in by a uh, canra or better known as amadite underscore nice name i like it uh cam i'm gonna just call you can because is that how I mean? i'm gonna just call you can mr can mrs can whatever can said at smojo fs here's my ice wizards uh stitch for tinder tasty t days my name is Valorant, and he's my silent knight. I can't wait to, to get the snowy owl mount for him uh, for the future. I like this one. I, I one of the main things that I like about this is the fact that you actually named your stitch. Uh, you, you called it the Silent Knight. I fuck with that. So the, it it adds character. Okay, it adds a meaning. You know what I mean? It, it adds value. You know what I mean? Silent Knight. I fuck with it. But yeah, thank you for submitting your stitch, my friend. I hope to see additional stitches by you in the future. And let's go ahead and rate this man's uh, stitchy Aruno. Let's go ahead and start with the first one, which is gonna be the googly eyes. The googly eyes means does it look good? Does this stitch look good, chat? You guys tell me in the comments. Do you like it? Rate, rate. Go ahead. Go to the comments right now. Rate his stitch one through ten. Rate it just without you even you know knowing what I think about this stage. Just rate his stage one through ten for me real fast. Hit that guy. All right, does it look good? I'm gonna say yeah. I'm gonna say yeah. Yeah, it does. Like if I were to be in the comments and I see your stitch, I'd take a double look at that guy and I'd be like, wow. That's a nice stitch, you know? Of course, there's some things that I would change. Uh, you know, I really love that robe. Perfect robe, by the way. Very, very nice. Very, very perfect robe. And I like the aesthetic of your stitch. Um, the only things that I don't like about your stitch is the hat and the boots. And I'm not saying I don't like it. Like, they don't work. They most definitely work, and they put the stitch together, and they're you know they're very nice however i do believe that there could possibly be better options that you could use to make this stitch even better now the name of your stitch is silent night and those boots most definitely go with the the whole theme of silent night honestly your entire stitch kind of issue goes with the theme of silent night um the only thing that would maybe change to fit your name better is uh, maybe using a sword or something uh, instead of the feather but i do fuck with the feather a lot but you know since you're using silent knight i don't know I don't, I don't see many knights fighting with feathers nowadays but i would i would maybe use a sword um but i mean i i still i still definitely definitely do like it another thing that i want to point out is i would definitely use a different hat um just to go with the feather i do believe there is a hat in wizard 101 that looks identical to the hat that you're using that has a feather on the side and i think that would fit perfectly with this stitch um if not i would probably use a hat that has a little bit more detail i'm gonna be honest with you the hat that you're using has like barely barely any detail in it like barely any detail the robe that you're using is pretty detailed and the boots that you're using are like mid-tier detailed um just so for everything to fit detail wise i would maybe use a different hat that has more detail 
um, and maybe use some different boots to have more detail as well. Um, maybe some boots from Darkmoor, maybe look around at some packs, something like that, um, just to add a little bit more flair to the boots, but also have that aesthetic of a silent night. And of course, it, you have to have it be black because the robe is black. So yeah. Overall, bro, I'm gonna give you, I think I'm gonna give you eight out of 10 on this one. Um, I think it's perfect other than the things that I said previously, which, you know, brought it down a little bit, but I do like it. I do like it. I most definitely do like it. Next up will be the brain. Does your stitch make sense? Does it actually make sense? Um, now we're talking about a silent night. It, it still goes with the things that I said before. Um, if I were just to look at this stitch without the name at all, I would say that it makes sense. However, I would change the boots because again, the boots are like a commander, a knight, you know, a guard, something like that. And then your cloth or your robe and hat that you're using, I, they just wouldn't work with your boots as far as does this make sense? But since you use the name Silent Knight, I see why, you know what I mean? So it's like, without the name, I would change the boots. With the name, I would keep the boots, you know what I mean? And with everything, I would probably change the wand to a sword, um, but that's really about it. But I do, I like, I feel like the sword matches the aesthetic of what you're trying to do, and it works, but for the sake of the name and yeah i would change it to a sword i'm not sure what kind of sword definitely not a katana but a sword in general that i i would use but i do like the wand I, i'll be honest i do like the wand warrior doesn't make sense rating i'm gonna give you a solid eight out of ten oh yeah i'm gonna settle with an eight out of ten because like your, the name that you use silent night i like it and i get it and my brain is just exploding right now now for uniqueness is his stitch unique um it kind of is but it's kind of not to be honest like your robe i believe you get that from a pack so that's like mid-tier uniqueness your hat you can get that for the bazaar and your boots i think that's the commander boots uh i'm a little bit iffy on those because i believe you get it from a crown shop which means you could just buy it i don't know if there's any other way of getting it please let me know in the comments if there is um and then the wand Oh, I don't think that's a, that's not a pack. I, I really don't know where to get it. I know, I don't think you get it from a pack. It's not from the bazaar. I think it's like a secret code that you put in and you get the wand or some shit like that. I'm really not sure, but you know, it is kind of, ish unique. Now, when we're talking about, do we see people using your gear often? Usually you don't see people using that robe in a stitch. You usually don't see people using that, that wand in a stitch. The boots, yeah, here and there you do. Um, and then the hat is just, you know, you, you do, but you don't, you know, it's like in the middle. So I'm gonna give you a solid seven out of 10 as far as uniqueness goes. Um, you got a little bit of unique stuff in there, but then again, you kind of don't ish kind of, it's like, a, it's a little jumbled, but I do like it. So yeah, seven out of 10 on uh, uniqueness. Before I give you my final rating though, I just want to mention to you guys that I am running an event called stitch off stitch off. is an event, um, with a $50 prize pool winner takes all, uh, it's, it's basically a stitch competition. Um, so if you guys are interested in that, hop inside the Discord server, sing your stitch inside of the respective channel, which is going to be hashtag stitch off. And that's really about it. That's all you got to do to enter. So yeah, go ahead and do that guy, run that guy, hit that guy. And you, my friend, I expect to see this stitch and stitch off. So I will be disappointed if it's not, I will be sad and cry. So yeah, overall reading came out to about a 7.6 out of 10. Um, but we're just going to round it up to eight because I don't like doing decimals. So yeah, I, I rate this stitch an eight out of 10 overall. It's not a bad stitch, could be better. You could definitely improve. Uh, I would change up the boots, maybe change up the hat to something that's a little bit more detailed so it can match and blend even more with your robe and maybe change the wand. But other than that, I think your stitch is pretty solid and you're going in the right direction to have a very unique and nice looking stitch. Very good. Well done. Very, very good. Well done, my sir. Very good. Well done. And don't forget, my friends, if you guys want to submit your own stitch inside of TTT, Triple T, Tender Tasty T Days, all you got to do is head over to Twitter, use the hashtag Tender Tasty T Days, make a post with your image. Follow me at Smojo SF. Make sure you add me in the post as well. And I will see your stitch in the next one, my friends. You guys have a great evening, morning, afternoon, whatever the shitty shit it is for you. I hope it's lady lit and i'll see you guys later thanks for watching don't forget the like so youtube can fucking bless me i guess and i'll see you guys later peace